They are back in what's sure to be the summer blockbuster for America's kids. The crowd from Monsters, Inc. will give us a look at their college days in Monsters University. That means Billy Crystal is back as Mike Wazowski, a little green guy with one eye and big dreams. Take a look. I don't mean to get emotional, but everything in my life has led to this moment. Let it not be just the beginning of my dream, but the beginning of all of our dreams. Gladys, promise me you'll keep auditioning. Marie, Mr. Wright is out there somewhere. Phil, keep using the ointment until that thing goes away. I wish you all the best. Thank you all so much. I'm welling up with tears. Now get off. <laughs> Big welcome now to Billy Crystal. Thanks for coming in. <laughs> So, so we just heard John Travolta tell us about the, the in-depth research he did for the killing season. How do you research Mike? Uh, well, I actually hung out with a little one-eyed uh, green guy for about <laughs> two or three weeks in his entire family. Well, we actually yeah. did our research. Mm -hmm. And we know that Mike is starting college right. in this movie. So we wanted to get a shot of you beginning college at Marshall University. Oh, oh God. There he is right yeah. there. I was a disc jockey on the campus radio station, <laughs> WMUL, the voice of Marshall University. <laughs> He was uh, probably back to parental guidance with that. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, it was all, that was a way to perform there. That was 1966. I was uh, 11, I think. You were looking good right now. Yeah, so, but you've said that Mike, um, that one-eyed guy, is one of the greatest characters you've ever played. I think he's my favorite character I've ever played because I, I just so relate to him. He's a, he's a little guy in a big man's world. He's, he's so optimistic. He doesn't let anything get in his way. And he loves his friends. And he's a leader. He, he won't let anything stop him from, from his dream. And I've always felt a, a kinship with that in anything I've ever done. Loves his friends and loves his work. And you get to work with one of your good friends in this as well, Sully, John Goodman. He's amazing. Well, we actually work together, too. I think that's the, the key word is that usually in these movies, you're in separate studios, you know, and uh, or you don't work together at all. But on the first one, I came in and he'd already done his part. So I said, well, I, I can't improvise or anything because his stuff is already done. So can't we call him and see if he'll come in? <laughs> and he did. And that, I think, makes the relationship very true. It's really funny that way. And our emotional scenes, which this movie has. Very emotional, yeah, absolutely. Are, are I, very saying, real. I had all my kids over last night with a couple friends of theirs, and they were completely mesmerized. But, you know, I was as well. It's, it's moving, it's got something for everybody. Well, you know, it's because they're 17. They're, 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 they're young kids in this movie. And, and the, the moral of this, of this movie is sometimes your dreams don't work out. And, and how do you get past that? And how do you move at that point in your life when you're starting to make decisions that are the ones that are going to impact the rest of your life? So, you know, the people at Pixar are just geniuses. And we're always working the story. It always has something for everybody. And it's something you can take your whole family to. You know, and there are no zombies. <laughs> not in this. So you're just telling me, though, I was surprised. When, when you all do the voices, you can't see anything. You don't see. Anything. No, I, did, I didn't see the finished movie till about a month ago. We do the voices first and then they animate to what we do. Because we play around so much that if we, like in the first movie, they explain to you where you are. It's, oh, you're walking onto the scare floor, right? And all these monsters are gonna be around mm -hmm. you. And so and they have pictures of some of them. And I said, I said to Pete Doctor, who's the director on that one, I said, could there be like a, an ooze on the floor and this big snail kind of thing goes by and it goes, we, we, can, we can try something that, like that. Right? And then, then, they, then you got this big slug walking across, <laughs> leaving a big slime thing. So it's kind of great. Walking very slowly across. Yeah. Billy Crystal, thanks very much. That's Monsters it? Univ that's it. What did I do? <laughs> I didn't, that's it?